Hello everyone, welcome to TechTed. In this lecture, we will go through the concept of foreign key. So, what is foreign key? So, let's start with definition. Foreign key is a key or an attribute which establishes relationship between two tables. So, let's understand it with an example. So, for example, let's say uh, we are going to have an activity in our college. So, this is a database in which we are maintaining activity so this is let's say call it activity table and this is the database of student in the college okay entire student now I don't want to maintain all the records for a student in the activity table like what is the name of student who has won the won that particular activity uh, from where the student belongs, which department and all, all those records. So what I'll do, I'll just maintain one of the key through which we can identify that, that which student he is. So what we will do is, let's say this is acti activity A1 and it was held on 27th of Jan and uh, the winner is, let's say, student S1 okay so in this case what we will do so the ID the student s1 has won this match so we are referring a student s1 okay student s1 now through this s1 we will go to another table which is student table and we will search who is s1 okay so this s1 should be unique right whatever I am referring here should be unique like there should not be two columns in this student table having two S1 as a ID right so this has to be whatever we are referring this winner that is winner okay this winner has to be a primary key in another table okay so this has to be a primary key now let's say s1 we got then using this s1 we can find the name is let's say fish and address is he is from let's say delhi okay so now we can identify what are the details of this particular student okay similarly if we have another student we will just refer it to let's say s3 in some particular event a2 and so okay so now we will again through this s3 we will refer another table and we will find out who is s3 so we will find s3 and then we will find find another details of that particular student so we are not storing entire detail of the student in this activity table okay we are just storing uh, storing a key through which we can identify or through which we can refer another table okay and find out the details of that student so every time to refer we are using using this key that's why it is also called referring key okay fine so this is uh, the concept of foreign key now we have as let's say now um, I'll first demonstrate the example so let's say another activity happens so this is a3 and student it was let's say on second fell okay and somebody wins so the somebody who wins that should be present here otherwise how you let's say s7 so this s7 which i am entering in this winner column should be present in this student table okay otherwise i cannot enter this s7 here fine so the important rule is that that whatever key we are going to enter that should be present in the referencing table okay or the referred table which we are referring okay now the next rule is that let's say I want to delete a this is student s1 I want to delete okay so when I am going to delete something from this table from this main parent table from to which we are referring 
then in that case we will have to delete all the references okay so let's say somebody deletes this s1 i'll delete this s1 it is now deleted and later on somebody refers this activity table and finds okay from this activity a1 who is the winner so s1 is the winner right now i'll i would like to know more about s1 and and i'll refer the student table but there is no there is no record here s1 is already deleted right so the conclusion is that before we delete a entry from the parent table or the referred table okay we have to delete all the references okay otherwise it will be a it will be a dangling pointer we have to delete all these references before we delete the entry from this uh, student table so these two important constraint constraints are there there over this foreign key okay before we enter the foreign key into the table we have to have that key present in this parent table okay and before we delete from this we have to delete all the references fine so i hope you understand this uh, if you have any doubt ask your question thanks for watching